going to tell you guys about my Diana creature. One of the many Diana creatures out there is the honeybee. Only female honeybees can sting you, did you know that? And all male honeybees do is mate. Ouch! There's a bee over there, just stung me. Oh, there it goes. Um, honeybees can also travel up to 200 beats per second and can travel to 6 miles in one flight. Well, that's about the honeybee. Bye! My name is Brian Simmons, and I'm here to tell you about pandas. Did you know that pandas can fill their tummies um, and they don't have to eat for another 12 hours? Did you also know that pan when pandas are born, they're born pink and are the size of a pencil? And finally, sadly, they're endangered, and there's only 1,000 more pandas. That's me with my pandas. My name's Emily. I'm hiding from a lion right now over there. I'll talk about the lion a little bit. But have to be quiet because you don't want him to hear me because he can eat me. But he is a crepuscular animal, which means he's active during twilight hours. Lions are the biggest of the of the cats. They're the biggest cats in the second biggest cats in the world, besides the Siberian tiger, which is the first largest cat. Also, they have the, roar, the loudest roars of all big cats being heard from five miles away. Also, lion cubs aren't just called cubs, they're also called whelps or lionettes. So that's my facts about the lion. I don't want to get eaten, so bye. Hi guys, it's me Kennedy, and today I'm going to be talking to you about my crepuscular creature, the wombat. Wombats are actually really cool. They're about this big, and they're fuzzy. Wombats actually eat only grass. They eat many sorts of grass, including snowgrass and crabgrass. Now, you could probably assume that wombats live in the grassy plains. Yes, they do. Lots of people actually wonder about why do wombats have square poop? And yes, it's true, they do. Wombats, most people think that wombats have square poop to mark, to mark where they've been so the other animals know that it was them who was there. Now, wombats are actually small, but they're very fast. They can run up to 25 miles per hour. They're really interesting animals, and... Oh my god! You guys, it's a wombat! Look over there! Now we have to be very quiet, though, because they're very sensitive, and they'll run off to their feet. Hey guys, I'm here to tell you about the white owl, right here. The white owl is a diurnal creature. That means it hunts in the day and sleeps at night. When it comes to white owl's eggs and nests, it is very aggressive. It'll, it'll, start, it'll start screeching and trying to attack the predator that was by its, its nest. Also, white owls are very nomadic. They, they move around very often and make nests in many other areas. Thanks guys. I'm Noah. Hey guys, Kate is here to tell me about you my nocturnal creature. The meaning of nocturnal is when an animal is awake or sleep during the day and awake at night. The nocturnal animal that I chose is a gerbil. Hey look, there's one now. Gerbils belong to the subfamily gerbilae. Did you guys know that the male the average male gerbil weighs about 2.5 ounces? Gerbils are related to rat mice and rats. They all belong to the family of Muridae. Bye, that's all for now. Hey guys, it's Kate it's here to tell you about my crepuscular animal. The crepuscular animal that I chose is the black-tailed jackrabbit. The black-tailed jackrabbit, also known as the desert hare, is native to western United States. Baby jackrabbits are born fully haired and with their eyes open. Their diet is shrubs, grasses, and small trees. Look, there's one now.
Thank you. Bye for now. Hi guys, it's Emma back with another scientific term. Today's scientific term is diurnal. Diurnal means an animal that is active during the day and asleep at night. One diurnal animal is a squirrel. In my research, I found that squirrels, ground and tree squirrels, are typically diurnal, while flying squirrels are nocturnal. If you don't know what nocturnal means, be sure to check out my other video talking about nocturnal bats. Did you know that squirrels are typically more awake in the early morning and the late afternoon, but never at night? In my research, I also found that squirrels will not hibernate, but they will typically spend more hours in their nest during cold months. Well, that's it about diurnal animals. Be sure to watch my next video talking about crocephular animals. Bye!